here from Lift of Life Garage. Appreciate you tuning in. Um, so obviously, as you can tell, the truck is under the knife currently. Um, time has come that we get this BDS six inch coilover kit uh, installed. So I've actually already gotten the rear put together and done, but I wanted to take some time while the shop was quiet to, uh, to kind of walk you through the BDS kit, why I chose BDS, um, and hopefully the ride quality that it'll give me out of the, the 2019 F-150. So um, the kit you see in front of you here on the table, this is the six, the BDS suspension, six inch performance elite coilover kit, okay? With a couple upgrades. So uh, this one comes with a 2.5 Fox uh, reservoir with the, uh, the DSC adjustment on it. Um, gives you a little bit more uh, control over the ride quality you're going for, whether it be for on-road performance, off-road performance, or anything along those lines. I also went with, which you can't see, or you might be able to see from the video, uh, the 2.5 rear shocks, um, just to give me that extra little uh, adjustment out of the rear and performance out of the rear. Um, I do plan on taking this truck off-roading. I'm gonna have a tent and rack that I'm gonna put on the back, do some camping, some overlanding, some things along those lines. So. I wanted to go ahead and go with the upgraded uh, 2.5 uh, performance shocks from Fox. Also decided to go with the upgraded uh, beefy BDS upper control arms as well. Again, I just I like the fact that it adjusts um, for uh, you know it has a rebuildable ball joint in it, so I can replace it. The arms are significantly larger. Um, and a big part of what helps control that factory ride. So um, now this kit is gonna come with literally everything you need um, in order to lift the truck six inches, okay? Um, so it's gonna have a front cross member, rear cross member. You're gonna have new knuckles that are adjusted to the six inches. Um, all of your drop back brackets for your sway bar, for your uh, differential, um, for the drive shaft spacer that you need. So it's literally an all encompassing kit. It even comes with a front skid, things along those lines. So couple reasons why I chose BDS. So there's plenty of lift kit options out there for everyone. Obviously there is, uh, you know, Ready Lift is a great company, Pro Comp, uh, BDS suspension, zone off-road, rough country, um, everything along those lines. So I have experience with a lot of different brands of lift kits, okay? Um, and I landed on BDS just because uh, it's, it's one, it's made and manufactured here in uh, Coldwater, Michigan, I believe. So it's a USA made product. Um, it's actually owned by Fox Suspension. So one thing I really liked about this kit is Fox was able to throw in some performance, you know, 2.5 coilovers designed and custom tuned for this kit specifically for this application of the F-150. Um, also, feeling all of these cross members and looking at the knuckles and all the components of the kit, they are beefy, okay? Um, there might be some additional weight that comes with that beefiness, but uh, I can tell by the design, the welds, everything on these, that these are really, really high quality, okay? Um, now, it's no secret that BDS is going to be a more expensive option on the market, um, but they're also known for their ride quality. Uh, it's kind of a known thing when you lift a truck that uh, you're gonna be changing the, the ride quality. You're not gonna get that factory um, ride quality after you go with a lift kit, all right? Um, a big thing that BDS is uh, prides themselves on is the ride quality itself. And um, they do that by incorporating, you know, uh, all the factory geometry when it comes to the CV shaft angles and everything along those lines into the, the design of their kit. So a um, couple other things, they have a no fine print warranty. Literally, if you break any of these components, you could straight up take your truck, go ramp it off-road and, and launch it in the air. You come down, you break a knuckle, you break a cross member, whatever, they will send you a replacement, no questions asked, okay? Um, they also have a supplemental warranty. So on this truck specifically, I actually have the Ford bumper-to-bumper -bumper warranty. Um, up until I think 86,000 miles or something along those lines. So um, it's a 2019 F-150 Lariat. It's fully loaded Lariat, it's 502A package. Um, so it's got a bunch of bells and whistles. With the bells and whistles also comes uh, more things that could potentially break or fail. One thing that was important to me before I go hacking up cross members and cutting the truck and everything along those lines, putting the lift kit on, is that I would not lose my factory bumper to bumper warranty. Now, ultimately, this does come down to whichever Ford dealership I try to take it to. They might say, hey, because you're running bigger tires or because you 
you know, cut the frame or whatever to install the lift kit, you actually cut brackets off the frame, little tabs, not the actual frame itself. Um, BDS has a supplemental warranty and a team of lawyers that come in and say, hey, you know what? we will cover the cost for that replacement or they will work with Ford to show or prove that their suspension was not the reason for failure. So um, it's added protection. Um, so again, narrowing it down to a few different things. Made in America, important to me, okay? I understand Fox shocks and some of the components might be made elsewhere, but the lift kit, the components, everything here is made and fabbed up in Coldwater, Michigan. Um, the quality of the you know, the, the lift itself, it, it keeps your factory steering geometry, um, everything along those lines. It's beefy components. I can tell the finish on this is extremely high quality. Um, so yeah, it's, uh, I just wanted to get on and kind of explain some of the, the features of the BDS kit, why I went with the BDS kit over some of the other options. That's not to say that other options are not good quality, right? Um, Ready Lift is, is a great lift, and I know that's very popular. They have several different options. Uh, Rough Country, people either love it or hate it, right? It's a, it's a, it's a budget option, so it's definitely gonna save you some money. Um, but uh, uh, ProComp, ProComp's another option that, that is uh, kind of your middle of the pack, uh, you know, lit, uh, suspension company out there. Um, all of which are good and will provide good ride qualities, right? Um, for me, factory ride as close as I could get to it was important and uh, and yeah I, want, I, I plan on taking this thing off-road you know putting it through the work so um, I wanted a suspension that could handle it and a company that uh, would back me if anything failed so um, appreciate you guys watching and uh, look forward to getting this thing thrown on and I will make sure obviously to get a video of the finished product to walk around and then we'll get out and we'll test this sucker. We'll uh, take it off-road. We don't have too many good off-road areas here in Chicago, but plenty of cornfields out west. I can go and uh, rip it through and, and see how this suspension works. So, all right guys, stay tuned.